Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Chrono Cross. Last time, we defeated Fate, and we started the side quest with Karsh and Riddle and Dario to get back Kid, which right now is at Hermit's Hideaway, kind of passed out. So, to wake her up, we need to get, um, something from, I think the Masamune or something. Uh, so, we needed to get that pendant, which we got, of course, from Salt and Pepper, and we need Riddle in our party. So I put Riddle in my party, I went ahead and equipped her elements and her equipment. So let's be sure to save. One quick thing that I'm going to tell you guys about this fight. In my personal opinion, this is the hardest fight in the entire game overall. So this is going to be attempt number one. I don't know how many attempts this will take. It Most average players... It'll take at least a couple. Uh, for me, I am I consider myself a good player at this game because I've played it so many times. Uh, but I don't have the black plate, so I didn't steal it from the dragon, so that kind of sucks a little bit. The other world. Okay. Dario, he's still alive. Look at that. So he didn't die. Yes. This cannot be. Are you Dario? But of course you are. This is another... <gasps> maybe he did kill him. And... You are alive and well in this world, so maybe he is dead in the other world. Are you saying you know who I am? What did you say? No, this cannot be. Do you know this man? I thought we just walk into strangers' homes. It has been four years since this man washed his sword clinging on for dear life. Every day was a battle between life and death, but miraculously he made it. However, this man has no recollection of his past whatsoever. Yes, dear, do you not remember me? I may be the riddle from another world, but every day I have always, and yet you do not remember who I am. Riddle, a name moves my heart, and I have a feeling I have lost someone very dear to me. Forgive me, I just cannot remember. If only there was something to reawaken your memory. Yes, and I'll take a look at this. This penda is a memento from your mother, and a gift you gave me when we got engaged. This is... Try to remember, we have been together since we were little, and we continue to be. I will always be there for you, Dario. Riddle. Run. Bro, what do you mean, run? Oh. Arg. Bro, he's got the mass immune with him, right? Riddle, riddle. That's right, riddle. This is bad. Uh, woo. You better stand back, lady. No, don't. Yo. Yeah, I was gonna say, yo, lady. Don't, don't, don't touch that guy, man. Karsh. What the? Bam. Sword on the ground. Amasa immune. <laughs> Dario. David. That's my name. No, Dario. Do not touch that sword. And he picked up the sword. Mm, riddle. Mine thirsts for something. I knew it. Amasa immune never actually disappeared from Death Gate. It just returned to its owner. Wait a minute. Then that means Dario still... What really happened? I thought Dario died fighting demons on the Isle of the Damned. Actually, now we get to find out what actually happened. Let's take a look. Is that the Mass Immune? Oh, I get it. So maybe he picked it up, went insane, and Karsh had to hit him. Is that a thing? Dario, what do you think you're doing? Oh, die. Oh, dude, bro, that's like your grandpa. Death to all living creatures. Bro, he's about to kill his own like, grandson. Don't tell me it's that sword, Dario. Let it go. Oh, Oh, and they're fighting. So that's what happened. Stop, Dario. It's me, Karsh. Dang. Karsh could literally be dead at this moment. Kill me, Karsh. Hurry. No. Do it, Karsh, or else I'll know Dario can't. Please step out of it, Dario. Hee hee hee, you idiot. I gave you a chance. You cannot beat me. You are but a mere mortal. Who the? First, I will dispose of you and then riddle. Oh, that's gonna make Karsh mad. I shall let the Masamune sate, sate itself on Riddle's blood. He 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 ha ha ha. Dang, yeah, that's not what you say to Karsh. Yeah, the second you mention hurting Riddle, Karsh is probably gonna hurt somebody. Dario, what have I done? So that's why Dario went insane touching the sword and Karsh had to kill him. Pathetic fool. You are. Dario was killed by demons, understand, Karsh? But are you going to tell everyone about what you just did? Are you willing to tell Are you willing to tell Riddle that you murdered Dario because he was possessed by the evil sword? Do not worry. Do as I say, and everything will be just fine. Dario. 
And Link's picked up the sword! I mean, Link's is already evil, so I guess it doesn't really affect him, right? And now I understand. Dario was possessed by the enmity of the Masamune too. Prepare yourselves. I guess there's no way out of this. I cannot face Dario in battle. To abolish the darkness, we must defeat the Masamune. It is the only way to save Dario. Let's fight! Except this is going to be a really hard battle. Face the enmity... Enmity of my oh my I can't read man This is a hard battle guys. I'm telling you right now. I said this I think earlier in the episode This is the hardest battle in the game in my opinion But we have to get it done. So what is it? Okay, so he is black. I Don't know how much HP does I didn't do much research, but oh that hurts a lot That hurts quite a lot and Riddle does like no damage, but we need her spells to be up. Orla should do a bit of damage. Dash and gash. It's not dash and slash. It's dash and... Did that kill her? She's already dead? Jeez, man. I don't know if we'll be able to defeat this guy. We're definitely gonna have to revive, though. Man, that hurts. I honestly have no idea how we're gonna beat this guy. I don't think we're gonna be able to. Uh, let's go back. Let's use heal all. Because Orla needs to be healed and so does Surge, so. Riddle should be a pretty good healer. So that's a plus. Hmm. Man, he hits so stupidly strong. And we're definitely gonna have to. You know what? Mm, maybe we'll leave her alone for a minute. Don't miss. I really need no. Ah, I really need nobody to miss right now. It's literally the worst thing that can happen is missing. Okay, Sonic Sword. Just don't hit Orla. Okay, hit Riddle. Okay, good. As long as it doesn't hit Orla, that's literally all that I need to happen. All that needs to happen. So I don't want to use a full heal. So let's just use one of the heals over here. Once again, as long... Okay, well, he can't Orla now. But, yeah. Or... Ugh, oh, missed. Don't miss again. Okay, the second one hit. Man. And I need to get... I need to get Riddle's... Oh, no. He's gonna attack right away. Man, and he hurts Surge really badly. I need to get Riddle's... You know what? I guess we'll just use an element right now. Uh, Cure Plus, right? Let's just go ahead and use that on Surge. Once again, Surge out of everybody is the most vulnerable since he is white. And he's also the strongest in my party. So I'm going to have to take like very, very good care of him. Make sure he doesn't get himself killed. At least he doesn't have revive anymore. So even if he dies, um, the revive is on Orla. But at the same time, Orla is fairly weak too. She could also get killed. Dash and gash. Just don't hit. How much health? Oh, she survived. She did survive this time. And I guess we'll just heal all. At this point, I just need her to be healed. She might need a bit more healing, though. Let's hit... Uh, you know what? Let's maybe just... Uh, let's maybe just use a... Oh, a Cure Plus on Orla. Yeah, make sure she doesn't die. That sucks, because I need a surge to attack, and we're putting him in kind of debt, but you know what? It's fine. Once again, I need Riddle to hit her shot so I could get a spell ready. Now, let's go ahead and just defend with her. Defend, and defend. Okay, and he's going to go attack. It's good. Orla's defending, so that's good. Let's go ahead and go with Surge. Please don't miss. Good hits. Good hits. Good. Okay, and let's go with Orla. Oh, I was trying to hit Sonic Sword. This shouldn't hit hard. 76. Good, good. So I didn't hit too hard. She could probably just heal herself. Yeah, she, uh, I don't know if this is going to take her to full. Okay, it did take her to full. Good stuff. Please. Okay, good. He didn't miss yet. Let's just do a couple little love taps. 
Oh, he's gonna hit Surge. This is gonna hurt. Oh, oh, he missed. Okay, good. Um, let's go back to Surge, I guess. Try to pull off one. Okay, and we could... Hmm. I'm debating. You know what? I'm just gonna do it. I really probably should be saving heal for Surge. But this move should do quite a bit of damage. And I kind of want to just do it already. So let's go ahead and pull it out. 500. Yeah, that does a... Con oh, don't kill Surge. Oh, of course it's on Surge. That's gonna, that's gonna kill him. Yeah, he that went above his health. Okay, so let's get Revive out. Yeah, let's get Revive. Hopefully he doesn't get hit like that again. Man, this battle's gonna suck. And with Riddle... Uh, let's go ahead and... What do these abilities do? Use... So, that's heal the party. What is this? Use a power. Cobra for protection. Do I have... Man, I don't have a single heal anymore. Okay, well, I guess we're just gonna use a heal all. At this point, I have to heal, so... I'm just gonna use a heal all, and that should take Surge quite out. I mean, if he gets hit by something like that again, he's gonna die no matter what. Ugh. Don't hit Surge. Surge is dead if he gets hit. Okay. Oh, Riddle's dead. That's not good. I don't know how we're gonna defeat this guy, honestly. I don't think he's even low. Oh, he's low. We're gonna have to, like, kill him quick. That's basically the strat. We gotta kill him quickly. Um, go to Orla. Let's try to do as much damage as we can before he does something crazy. You know what? Let's just... We gotta go all in at this point. Missing would be... Missing would be devastating. Oh, no. He's gonna hit Surge. Surge is dead. No! He's not dead. That's so good. I... I really need... Right now, missing is... If we miss, it's over. Good. Good hits. Free fall. Don't hit... Okay, it's Orla. Honestly, I don't care. I just need... I need Surge to maybe not get hit. That killed her. Ugh, she was full health. Is that it? We beat him. Oh, that's such a relief. I honestly don't even care that Orla didn't get it. Imagine if he would have killed us with less than 35 HP. I would have flipped. That's also kind of annoying, though, that he was... Like, seriously, Orla couldn't have killed him. Man, that, that, was, that was quite a fight. Hmm, it appears the mouse immune found a new master. What, Surge? Do not panic. Look around you. Birds. The birds that fled are coming back. I no longer sense the slightest bit of malice from the Masamune. There is no there is no more fear of succumbing to the enmity. Mune. Ha. You awake, Masa. Masa. But looking, I think we've done something terrible. Mune. Ha. No one will know if, if we don't tell. <sighs> hey, what are you two up to? Yikes. It's Dorian. Nothing. We don't remember a thing. Dorian, I see. Well, just make sure you're not up to any mischief. I'm coming along. All right. How many centuries has it been since the three of us got together? Okay, then. Let's go. Hey, so the Moss Immune seems like it's chill now. Cool. Surge's Sea Swallow transformed into the Master Immune. Look at that. Where, where am I? I also heard that the Master Mune is actually the best weapon for a Surge in the game because of its high critical stat, so it's pretty good. Riddle, is that you, Riddle? What happened to me? Dario, thank goodness your memory has returned. Memory, oh yes, I had taken a hold of the Master Mune when, forgive me, Karsh, for what I have done to put you through. Oh, forget about it. Although your memory has returned, let us not forget the harsh reality which lies in wait. Come. So, you will be leaving. I have been prepared for, for this day. Hmm. Farewell, I wish you all the best. Okay, so she seems to take a pretty chill, so that's good. Every, everyone is hurt and separated, inexperienced and incomplete. However, by living as such, we may change for the better into something bigger. Something more gentle. 
Oh, now we're back. My goodness, what has happened during my absence? Where have the general and the others gone? They're dead, my dude. Riddle, you said that you all came from another world. Then where are Karsh, you, and the others in this world? Unfortunately, no one from Viper Manor who went to the Dead Sea will return. Why did the general and the others go to such a dangerous place? In search of the frozen flame. They were swallowed up by a terminated timeline and have perished along with the Dead Sea. So how ironic that it is I who have survived. Eh, a little bit. But Dario, you still have me. Riddle. We may be from different worlds, but you... We may be from different worlds, but you are not I, and I am I. Yo, that's right. I'm live and kicking too. There ain't no one who can take my life. Zoa and Marcy are here too. We can also call the old dragoon stable keeper. Thank you, everyone. Does he join the party? Yes, you're right. I am alive, and I will do whatever I must do. I do not know how many years it will take, but I will re... No, he doesn't join. Okay. I will rebuild Viper Manor. It is my duty. My might. Perhaps it's about time I came out of retirement. Time for a one last hurrah. Ho ho. Oh yeah, bring it on. Even though we may be from different four worlds, the four divas are back in business. But maybe minus one. I don't think you're fit for battle yet. Forgive me. Four years of isolation have, have taken their toll. Are you alright? Riddle. I want you to take this. Snake Fang. So that is another move. Please rest up and just concentrate on rebuilding Viper Manor. Thank you. I shall do so. Of course. I will help you too. Plus, I have an idea. Does this mean Riddle leaves the party? That wouldn't be cool. So is that it? So I guess that's it. Um, I'm pretty sure we have... Let's see, what does he say? Hmm. Well, I did say I would open the doors to all the children who lost their parents during the past struggle. However, this remodeling job is a little too... We have to bear in mind that children will be living here. We, we Why not officially make this place an orphanage? Okay. So this place is an orphanage now. Let's check it out. I just accidentally... Okay, please let me get out of that voice line. So, I guess... Actually, this might be hard to believe, but I've never actually... Or, is this it? Can we not go back in Vi- Oh, okay. I was like, I don't know why it wouldn't let me back in Viper Manor. Okay, so... I'm guessing we can't go in. No entry. Okay, so the interior is still... Under construction. Is there something over here? Okay, so basically the thing is just being built. I don't think there's anything to actually do. Obviously, these are little orphanages. Orphans. Can we go down here? So this explains the noise I was coming from above. We can still go down there. That's interesting. It's a dragon stables ready. Okay, so let's go ahead and head back to the island. And we'll be able to get Kid back, I think, now. Alright, so um, I took everything off Riddle because, like I said, I think we'll be able to get Kid back after this last mission. By the way, real quickly, I know this is like in the middle of the episode, but... I'm going to turn on my lights here because I want to see a bit better. Okay, so let's head over to the island. We're in the wrong world, though. I think we have to... Yeah, we have to go to the other world quickly. All right, we are in the right world. Let's go ahead and head to Hermit's Hideaway. And uh, let's see. I know with this, though, we are going to have to do like a little mission. So we're not going to just like wake her up and... Uh... She'll be with us. We're going to have to do a little side quest, but it's really cool, in my opinion. So hopefully you guys should be able to enjoy it. We're gonna get a little bit of a uh, little bit of backstory, which is gonna be nice. Huh? It's the princess, Mune. Let me see. Whoa! I think you're right. I wonder what happened. Did you think we should help her, Mune? Or yeah, not. Nah, it's not our job. Yeah, I guess so. It's probably out of our league anyway. Yep. Hey, aren't we heartless? Ah, sis, but the princess is bound by the past, and even we can't bring her back here. Look closely, see that? Hey, it's the the time egg. Yes, although it's not in, in its complete form, did that girl with the glasses make it? Probably, even though it's in its incomplete form. If we can focus our powers into it, then maybe it'll work. Yeah, okay, new masters. Hmm. Who's talking? Yep, it's you. Uh, we're going to lend you our powers for a little bit. He's talking to Serge. 
We're sending you back to the past where the princess is bound. We only have one chance. Take care of the princess. Master. All right. We're going back in time, boys. Let's do this. I'm pretty sure only Surge gets taken, right? Oh, no. Oh, all three of us do get taken. Okay. Okay, so this is the orf Luca's orphanages. Um, Miss Kid and Mistress Luca are stuck in the back room. I'm sorry that I lack the power to help you, Fizz. Looks like we're gonna have to beat this lava boy. Alright, so I did make a little mistake. Riddle does not have her items. Uh, but it should be fine. Riddle will be fine. We should be able to beat the crap out of anything here with Surge, right? Hopefully. Man, these lava boys are a little bit tougher than the other ones. Let's just try to kill this one so he doesn't attack. Yeah, these ones are definitely tougher than the ones at Mount Pyre. I'm not going to bother with the riddle. No, nope, don't bother. just want to kill these things with some raw damage. I was like, does this thing, is this thing going to attack Lava Rush? Oh, okay. And this shouldn't hurt too badly. Bam. One. It did a single one damage. Oh, come on. Don't miss. That's so tilting. I just want the thing dead. Ah, there we go. I want to get these battles over quickly. And it is kind of annoying that I took off all of Riddle's stuff in preparation, but I forgot that we still do need to do a couple battles. Let's try the middle room. Let's see what's up in here. Um, well, there's a lava boy blocking the door. Stardust cape. I wonder what that does. Oh, looks like we're going to have to fight another one. All right, there is another lava boy down. Uh, let's check the two rooms upstairs and downstairs, left and right. Um, is there, this floor looks like it can be removed. Yes, let's remove that. Let's jump in and see what is over here. Um, what is over here? Oh, we got to the other part of the room. Well, let's just check this room, whatever. Might as well, let's just get it over with. Okay, a beautiful view of of space. So this must be Luca's science room. I don't think there's anything in here. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here. Let's check this room though real quick. Oh, this is the upstairs. Some diva dress. And I can't get over here. Alright, let's go back. Uh, I think we could save that kid, right? Is it the other room? I guess let's take a look. If we go back up. If we... Okay. Oh, we just ran past it. Okay. I think we can save the kid. Alright, there goes... That lava boy. Let's see. Let's talk to the kid. What's up? Whoa, mister. You sure are strong. When I grow up, I want to be just like... Oh, yeah. Here, mister. Take this. Nostrum and there are other kids hiding and there are other kids hiding in this room also I saw another one of us in the bedroom wait where oh I was like what do you mean in this bedroom where is this bedroom uh, real quick let's go ahead and uh, get rid of the burn though okay so we saved that kid apparently I don't know how just leaving him in the fire is saving him no I didn't mean to hit him Okay, guys, so there's a couple things that we missed. So let's go back. Um, if we go back here, there should be a kid hiding. Um, is it in this room? Where is the ice? We're supposed to get an ice gun. Just gotta figure out, is it? Oh, in case of fire, use this ice gun. Okay, yeah, okay, let's take the ice gun. Cool. Sorry, but this is all the power that I have. Oh, God. Okay, there was a, a ghost kid. Creepy. Oh, there's the kid. 
Thanks a lot, mister. I didn't make it out in time. Uh, there's still the other rooms. You gotta... Okay, yes, it's going to be okay. Gee, thanks. Take this. Rainbow shell. Cool. Okay. So, we did get the rainbow shell, so that's good. Okay, so... Yes, under the bed, there is another kid. I knew it. Thank you. Or, here, take this. So, we got another rainbow shell. Cool. Um, yeah. So, we got three kids. I think that's all of them. I do think that is all of them. So, we basically just have to defeat each lava boy. Uh, okay. And I don't want to defeat this one again. I already defeated this one like a thousand times. So now we only have one. You know what? Two characters have already disappeared. You know what? I'm just I'm just gonna run away. Try to use the ice gun. I don't feel like taking three of these things on with only surge. It's gonna take forever. So come on, let us okay. Let's see. Can I use the ice gun? Bam. Okay. Oh, okay. I was like, well please let me just get through. Bam. Okay, and there's um, I think that's Kid on the floor. And maybe that's why Kid wants to kill Link so badly. And it poofed off. That's definitely Kid. It's burning. Our home is burning. Luca, all my friends, they're, they're... Why? Why did this happen? You. Are you going to go away? Are you going to leave me? I'm going to be left all on my own again, aren't I? Everybody I've ever loved has gone far, far away. I won't leave you. Yeah. Really? Do you mean that? Ugh. Your cheek, it's wet. Thank you. Thank you for saving me. Will I will ever see you again? Oh. Oh. So when she was little... Did she see me? What? Where did you go? No, come back. Don't leave me. Ugh. Man... Making me sad. No, no, no. This is making me sad. Come on, Links. Why do you have to do that, man? But I think, I think we got Kid back. Serge, how have you been? I'm right here. Hey, kids are in the party. Let's get it. Thank, thank goodness. This must be the power of Serge's love. Ah, yes, kid. Lucia is waiting for you in her lab in Viper Manor. She wanted to give you something. Anyway, there's no rush. I suggest you rest here for a day. So, Lucia is waiting for us? Oh, we'll definitely check it out. But yeah, what, my wound? Link stabbed me? What are you talking about? Oh yeah, she's still back at, all the way at uh, Viper Manor, or uh, uh, Mount Pyre. Oh wait a minute, not again, I lose my, but whatever. I'm in dangerous situations where I might get, I just seem to disappear and vanish. And when I come to, I wake up somewhere safe without a single scratch. But the thing is, I can't remember what happened. I don't get it. Anyway, it's happened to me plenty of times in the past, so it's nothing to worry about. Come on, mate, let's go. Yeah. Apparently I saved her in the wild. I don't know, this place is confusing, man. 
All right, Coolio. So, the is that it? Do we have kid back? Okay, so let's let's check. Do we have kid back? And if we do, I'm putting her right in. Yes, we do have kid. Cool. Okay, well I'm putting her in. Uh, real quickly, I'm gonna do her elements and her equipment. All right, everybody. So we are here at Viper Manor. We're gonna go talk to Lucia real quick uh, because that's what. Uh, Whatever the person's name told us to. So, yep, let's do it. I've been waiting, kid. There's something I want to give you. Hmm, me? I was told to give it to you when the time was right. It's for you. From Luca. You knew Luca. Oh, this Lucia knew Luca. Here. What is it? My dear kid, how are you doing? I wonder how old you are as you read this letter. Perhaps you have matured into a beautiful woman, raising a happy family. Ugh, I don't think so. I was going to talk to you in person when you were old enough, but just in case something happens, I'm writing my feelings down on paper and leaving it with Lucia. Perhaps you already know, or perhaps you yourself are... You are also now caught up in some historic crisis as a result of all this, but anyway. A long time ago, we, my friends and I, that is, changed the future in order to save our planet from being devoured by Lavos Monster from some unknown planet. We still feel proud of our role we played in saving our world and how we are so freely able to change the flow of time. But sometimes I think that the darker side of what we did, what has become of the future that was once supposed to have existed, where did the time that now is no longer allowed to exist to go? It is true that thanks to our altering the flow of history, we are able to save so many lives and prevent so much sadness and suffering. But when you think of it, we also caused the deaths of many that were meant to have come into existence in the timeline we destroyed and also cause new sadness and suffering further along in the new future we created. That is why I worried that someone might seek revenge on us for what we did. I have had a constant dread in my heart that someone in our new future will travel back in time just like we did and try and kill or capture my friends and me. So even if something dreadful does fall, fall on me, kid, know that what was meant to happen will happen and that I was always prepared for the worst. But don't you dare think that great Lucia is going down, Luca is going down without a fight. Whatever lies waiting for us around the next corner, better watch out because it's going to find a pretty mean counter. Kid, when I think of you, I remember someone I met once a long time ago in the distant past. But she was the complete opposite of you in this timeline, so quiet and gentle. I'm talking about uh, Scala, uh, or Shala. Someday I'll also tell you about her when you are ready to know of your real name and heritage. I'm not... This I'm not the slightest bit worried about you, kid. I know that no matter what happens, there will always be there looking for you. Or per perhaps he has already found you and is there by your side as you read this. If so, hello, Janice. Please take good care of my little sister for me. There is so much more I want to tell you, but I must leave it for another time. Don't worry, everything is okay. We will overcome whatever will may occur, that's for certain. So basically, uh, later when you're all grown up, I'll come visit you and we'll talk over to you. I look forward to that. So what was she was talking about? Well, anyway, kid, until we meet again. She was talking about that she's met someone like her forever and ever your friend, no matter what timeline it is. You're sincerely, Luca Ashed here. So it's a very long story, and I don't want to, P.S., cut the tomboy act. Believe me, you'll become a beautiful young lady one day, or my name isn't Luca the the Great. Uh, so I don't want to do it like big spoilers, but basically, Lavos, sorry, but I like to be alone for a while, becomes the Dream Devourer, which we're going to fight later. Basically, that is Lavos combined with Shala, and Kid is uh, basically a clone of Shala. I can't believe you, sis. You're the one who always laughed about how there's nothing definite or certain in this world, sis. Received rainbow shell. Hey, there's another rainbow shell. Cool. So that is more material making material. I like it. All right, guys. So that is basically it. Now, once again, I'm going to recommend you guys, if you want to know more about like the timeline, because it's a very confusing game and story, go look it up. And again, I don't want to like be a spoiler, but basically, if you guys know what's going on, Kid is a clone of Shala. Shala was a person that uh, Luca met in her travels with Chrono in, obviously, the game Chrono Trigger, which was the, the prequel, not prequel, whatever, the game before this. Uh, but I'm not going to go deep into it. Like I said, you guys should research it yourself. It's very interesting. I highly recommend it, although confusing. But guys, that's going to be it for today's episode, guys. Thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as support on the channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.